Hey everybody, I have some goodies to share. Um, I placed an order with um, Callie's Crafts and Supplies, and that is Barb's store, and that's Callie's Crafts and Supplies.com. And I will put a link to her channel in the description below so you can go on over there and check it out. I have two parts of this is the order that I placed with her last week and then um, my second half is she sent me some goodies because she wants me to create something for her store um, like a little small guest design team thing I guess um, so anyways the first this is what I purchased and I was in love with and actually she actually had sold out of it and had to order more so it's really smoking hot so um, that was the the paper that I'm going to show you. Um, but anyways, I wanted to try out this art glitter with the fine tip applicator, the um, the the adhesive. And I know a lot of people are using that, and that's good for um, you know the little intricate um, pieces, parts to you know making minis or your projects. You know the fine laces and everything. So I wanted to give that a try because um, you know it's. I don't. I, I want to see how this fine tip applicator works. I've seen so many people use it and love it, and you know you can get a small amount of glue on a very small space without making a mess. So, anyways, and then I wanted to get the. Um, I was in love with this. I saw Barb make a tag out of this paper, and it's the A4 paper pad of the Garden Fable, and I just fell in love with this paper. And I gotta tell you guys, this is the first time I've ever. Um, had an A4 paper pad and I don't know why we don't make this in every collection or uh, uh, manufacturer or designer or whatever because I am in love with this size. I was not aware of the way this was. I don't know when I always heard A4 paper I thought it was like smaller than the 6x6 thinking an A4 card. So yeah I was surprised. I never really look at the measurements but these papers are super pretty. I love it. I'm sure you've all seen it, but... So I can't wait to make a project with that. And I don't know, I think these, this paper would look good with the Prima Dolls. I, that's just my vision. But anyways, the, in case you're like me and you never read the sizes of things, A4 paper is 8.27 inches by 11.69. So it's just slightly bigger than 8.5 by 11, which I think is really cool because, you know, when I do this 6 by 6, it's too small to make a mini album the size that I like or a page or... So you can do both. I'm really in love with this size paper. So, and then to go with it, I got the, which I never really do get the collections um, chipboard pieces to things, but I just really loved this. It comes with these feathers and um, the little pieces of chipboard and everything. So I really like that. Can't wait to dig in there and play with that. And then I also ordered the, um, the little stamp set that goes with it. And this is just really adorable. It's got the little bird, flower, teacup, and that's perfect for, you know, if you want to stamp on your tags or if you're making a journal or something. So, love that. And then, I will show you what she included in there for me to do some creating. And I was just shocked, Barb. You went way above and beyond. I really thought I was just going to get some paper. But, so she sent me um, this A4... Um, let me just pull this all out. The another A4 pad in the Time Traveler. Uh, in the Time Traveler from Prima, and um, I love it. The, I don't. Gosh. Oh, they're gonna get crazy. Look at this. This is gorgeous. These can be cut apart as tags, or you can still just use it as the paper. So this is really nice paper. I love it. Look at that. That is so me. Of course they wait till I video to start wrestling around with the dogs. Look at that. It is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I'm in love with this. I didn't really even look at this. This paper, there's some, um, which I actually did in my next order with her. 
this paper mimics some of these um, chipboard pieces that she has that are really long and cool that I want to order. I guess I'm not explaining that well, but look in the background of this you can see the roses or flowers. So yeah, I'm in love with this stack. Look at that. Just gorgeous. Look at that. Oh. Tickets. Beautiful. So I can't wait to create with that. Thank you so much, Barb. And I will make something beautiful for you. Um, and then to go with that, she gave me these. They, they have the ATC pads. And this is for the time traveler as well. These are really thick. Really nice to make journaling spots. And it matches the whole paper collection. So I love it. Look at that. Really cool. So if you're picking that up, better pick that up too. And then here's a stamp that goes with that. And there are little buttons that goes with the paper. Super cute. And some chipboard embellishments. This is from Blue Fern Studios. And... Um, it's got a hot air balloon in there and just some really nice pieces to add to your stuff. And then she sent me these cool jars. I had created a big mason jar, so um, like a name sign mason jar. So I'm going to put something together real cute with those, with the straws that I have. And then these wood pieces. Love it. This goes with um, the time traveler as well. So look at those cool clocks and keys. So I love it. Real excited to create a mini with that. And then this paper is really awesome that she's... Oh, and she also sent me the um, the chipboard pieces. One fell out. It's in here, but it's floating around. The chipboard pieces for the Time Traveler. So, yep. Can't wait. Can't wait. Thanks so much, Barb. I'm in love with this collection. And then this was the one she had in mind for me to do something with for her and this is the um this is by blue fern studios i got it all mixed up because i was going through it but anyways this is the love i think it's love story hold on let me read yeah love story collection from blue fern studios and this paper let me zoom out a little bit so i can get more of it in this paper i'm telling you is as thick as chipboard almost well not that much but it's thicker than normal thick paper let me tell you that so this is really pretty they're reds and blacks but yet it's like a soft red so it's almost like a mauvey pink and just a it's not like a bright red it's really really pretty and I love it look at the violin really nice and they're two-sided so there's that one and I just showed you that one. So there's two of each. And this is so pretty. Look how the chandelier. Just real. I love this collection. It is really pretty. And on the bottom you can even use like the edging to cut out. Which I like doing that. So And there's the back. A real soft green. Loving these colors. This is really nice. This is the first thing of blue fern I've had. So I got to say I'm impressed with it. Look at this amazing heart, all the edging, and that, oh my gosh, I didn't even see this one. Oh, am I in love with that page. Look at that. I love it. So, okay, and then I already showed you that one. And did I show you this one? Yep, that was the one we just looked at with the cool back. And then this is really cool. It's got like the card side. Look at the edging on that. Really super pretty. I love it. And that's the back. Look at that. That's that. Ooh, this one's pretty too. I'm going to have fun creating with this, guys. Can't wait to show you what I come up with. Don't have it in my... Look at that. As soon as I shut this video off, I'm going to get started on making a mini. So that's the same. These are, um, I'm telling you, this stuff is so thick. I wish you could feel it. So this is the little cutouts that come with it. 
sweet forever darling a love like no other and these can all be cut out and there's two of those and that's the back like a wood grain and this toile I think that's what you call that very nice and look at that and the birds oops the flowers the birds loving it loving it loving it that's the same and then last but not least there's this this is a, like a soft grayish mint green it's real subdued it's got brick wall it's just gorgeous gorgeous paper collection and then that's the back all right thank you so much barb guys head on over to Callie's crafts and supplies she has tons of um, wonderful things in her store and um, I can't wait to create something really good and, and um, do a video on that and um, go check it out talk to you later everybody bye